from beautiful Bali. If we haven't met yet, I'm Jeremy. I'm Rani. And we are on the motorbike and we're headed to the harbor here at Nusa Lembangan. Coming to you right now from the Honda Scoopy on Nusa Chenangan. We're making our way back across the island this morning. And yeah, we're gonna be at the harbor soon. In this video, we're gonna share our travel day across Nusa Chenangan and to Nusa Lambangan and then back to the main island in Bali where we will be staying for a couple nights before we move on to another island in Indonesia. So stay tuned. All right, let's go. This is the main road across Nusa Chenangan. It goes by all the popular little cafe spots that are along the coast. And soon we'll be crossing the Yellow Bridge, which connects Chenangan with Lambangan, where we continue on the main road that goes all the way to Lambangan Harbor. And we have an 11 o'clock fast boat appointment this morning to go back to the main island of Bali. style on the motorbike with all the luggage balancing everything on the jungle road. Oh, bumpy road with all the luggage. Bags trying to fall off the motorbike. Balancing everything. The links we go to to drive across an island to stay at a beautiful villa resort. In case you're curious, the cost for a motorbike rental on Nusa Lambangan or Nusa Chenangan is about 80 KIDR per day, which is about six US dollars. We will definitely put our contact in the description of this video. So when you do come on Lambangan, you can go to someone you know right away and have your bike ready for you, all fueled up and ready to get the keys and go. Here 
Cruise of Lemna gone. About to get back on our fast boat ferry back to the main island of Bali. Just waiting for a couple of passengers. Such a beautiful beach here at Lembangan. The sand is nice. The water is clear, blue, turquoise. And the sun is hot, as always. Let's go. Okay, we're on our uh, fast boat now. We got ready. our seats. We are ready to left now. Hopefully, we have an uneventful trip back to Bali. The water's calm here, but we'll see when we're out on the ocean. We'll see. We just got in our grab, we got off the ferry, got through all the taxi drivers. <laughs> just say no, keep walking to the circle. It's very close to the ticket office. You can order your grab right there. Easy pickup. We're now in the grab car and we're headed to our hotel check-in here in Bali on Legian Street. So we'll be there very soon. Fairfield Hotel here on Legion Street and yeah we're checking in right now and soon we'll get to our uh, surprise upgrade suite and we'll show you everything that the suite has to offer. sitting at the restaurant here at the Fairfield in Legion and we're waiting for our grand suite to be cleaned and prepared for us. Just checking out the menu and getting some uh, welcome offerings from the hotel. Relaxing and glad to be in one place now for a few nights. We'll show you our luxurious grand suite soon. Welcome to Indonesia's famous local beer, Bentang, with lime and fresh fruit. Hi again, we are finally checked into our suite here at the Marriott Fairfield in Legian. We're back on Bali's main island. We have to tell you, the suite upgrade was fantastic. We are finally checked in here now and we're definitely going to give you a room tour now of our suite. This is called the Larger Grand Suite, suite yeah. here at the Fairfield Marriott in Legion, mm -hmm. and it is fully equipped. You could stay here for an entire year if you wanted to. The space is big enough, yep. it's got everything you need, mm -hmm. and we're about to show you all the special features that this room <laughs> has that is more than enough for any kind of hotel stay. First things first, I know everyone's curious how much a grand suite like this costs at the Fairfield in Bali. The truth is, I don't know. <laughs> if you check the Marriott Bonvoy app, it'll give you the daily rate, which I'm sure is always changing. Mm -hmm. But most importantly, we stayed here for absolutely free. So if you're a member of the Marriott Bonvoy program, of course you accrue Marriott Bonvoy points. 
And as we discussed in a previous video, we stayed at a Marriott hotel for over a year. So we accrued quite a few points. And so we booked this Marriott Fairfield in Bali for a few nights for absolutely zero dollars. <laughs> and you can't beat that deal, right? Free is great. So if you're not familiar with the Marriott Bonvoy program, you accrue points based on the amount of nights that you stay with Marriott throughout the year, and then you earn different tier status as you go along. This hotel was an incredible deal of only 5,000 Marriott points per night, which if you know anything about the program, you know 5,000 is very cheap. And if you ever get that kind of deal, you should definitely book it on the app. As I mentioned, we stayed with Marriott over 300 nights last year. So we're at a pretty high status now, which is also a bonus because when you check in to a hotel, whether you paid for it or not, maybe you booked it on the, the point system, it doesn't matter, you still get your tier benefits, which is usually you know priority check-in, yep. upgrades, which is what we benefit from this time, and of course free breakfast and things like that. So earning tier status is definitely something you want to do. And as I've said before, if you're going to stay with a hotel, you should get rewarded for it. All right, now we're gonna jump into the hotel suite tour. So as you'll notice, when you come into the entryway of the room, there is a great uh, kind of open area for sitting. Yeah. And you immediately have a bathroom and walk-in closet to your right. Yeah. And then you come around that area, you're gonna see a working desk, but also uh, the giant king bed and two smart TVs, smart TV. <laughs> one for your sitting area and one for your king bed area. As you'll notice, the sitting area and the king bedroom area are kind of shared and divided by the two smart TVs that are in the partition, but really it's a big enough space for all those things, plus you have the working desk right there so you can kind of do multiple things at one time, and the space really is enough for all three things. Plus, I like how everything is relatively close, so when you're charging different things at different plugs, it's not so far away to get to each thing when you're charging and need to access different things, which we usually do when we're working. I feel like I'm constantly grabbing things from different bags, and it's really nice that everything is very conveniently located close to my computer at the work desk. Speaking of which, the room has plenty of international plugs. Yes. So beside the king bed, we both have plugs on our bedside uh, tables. Uh, all the plugs are international, I believe, and the room has probably at least 10, plus the bathroom also has international plugs. I think we both probably enjoy the walk-in closet. It's great for storage. Yeah. We have quite a few bags and different things that we're traveling with, so having a walk-in storage area to just put all of our luggage and let everything rest in there out of our way is a big plus. Yes. The bathroom has a walk-in shower with a rainfall shower head, of course, but also a handheld shower as well. And you have your normal uh, storage area for you know, a sink and all your toiletries, but also a comfortable toilet area and everything as well. And if that space is not enough for you, you also have an outside area, which we are currently in right now. You have a nice garden space out mm -hmm. here. And I think Ronnie's favorite, what is it, Ronnie? Bathtub with the jet. Oh, yeah. that's perfect. <laughs> There's an incredible whirlpool outside in your garden area that's totally private and you have jets of course in that tub so you can enjoy the massage, enjoy your bubble bath and be outside and totally private. We are going to spend the rest of the day just taking it easy, doing some editing, knocking out some work before we actually leave Bali again. again? <laughs> so we only have a couple days before we're back on the road again so we're going to enjoy this nice grand luxury suite here at the Fairfield. Tonight we may go down to the beach, show you the sunset and have dinner there, but other than that this is pretty much going to be our day. We're going to enjoy the luxury while we have it. Yeah. decided to skip the sunset today here in Legion and enjoyed our luxury whirlpool bath. They also had a local Zumba class that was here today, so that was great entertainment. Yeah. 
And of course, there's always editing and travel planning to do, so we kind of got lost in all those things. Mm -hmm. And really just enjoying the luxury of the Fairfield Marriott Suite they gave us. Yes. Really enjoying that. Really soaking up every minute we have left before we have to get back on the road and travel to our next destination. Mm -hmm. So big shout out, big thanks to the Fairfield Marriott here in Legion. Before we end this travel day here in Bali at Legion, I want to tell everyone that's watching our videos to go ahead and go to our website, KentuckyAndsAbroad.com. Sign up for our newsletter so you know where we're going to be at next. We sometimes ask folks in our newsletter for recommendations or suggestions of where we should visit when we come to your city, wherever that's at in the world. If you enjoy the travel video content we're making, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Check that notification bell so you know when our new videos are coming out each week. And if you enjoyed the travel video today from Nusa Chenangan over to Bali's main island at Legion, go ahead and smash that like button and share it with your friends. But remember, you don't have to be a Kentuckian to travel with us. You just gotta have fun. Stay safe, stay healthy, and keep on keeping on. Cheers. Cheers.